Sometimes Will Smith and Bruce Willis aren't available to protect the planet, so music has to step in. In the history of future folk, an assassin and a general from another planet come together to form a band and try to save the Earth. This movie is a blend of great comedy, beautiful songs. It's a bit of a screwball film, but it has a ton of heart. General Trius of Hondo lives on our planet as Bill with the love of his life and their little girl. At night, he sneaks off to a local club, dons his old armor, and plays folk music. His mission was to unleash a virus which would allow his world to invade ours, but that all changed the first time he heard music. An assassin named Kevin that's right, an alien named Kevin, is sent to kill him and finish the mission. Trius captures him, plays guitar for him, and changes his mind. Together they form a folk duo, and they try to save the planet they call home, because Hondo isn't done with them yet. As completely strange as that breakdown may sound, this is a wonderfully funny and wholesome movie. I mean, very early on it touches your heart, so you don't care if it makes any sense. You just get caught up in the hilarious and the warmth, which is a difficult combination for any film to pull off, but this one does it effortlessly. Now, if you are looking for dark comedy, look elsewhere. The jokes are here, are original, they're lighthearted, never dark or rough. Niels D'Alaire and Jay Klatz, are future folk. D'Alaire brings a very stoic, strong character to Trius, but he also has a wry sense of humor that makes him a joy to watch. Now, Klatz turns the mighty Kevin into both the comedian and the comedic foil. He looks like a manic fish out of water. Together, their comic timing is only matched by their musical ability. I am not a fan of folk music, but the songs in this movie were moving. They were beautiful, and sometimes they were about an alien world, but they were done so well that they actually touched me. Now, these two characters were created to be performed on stage by the main actors, so they decided to give it a shot and bring them to the big screen, and I think they've done a beautiful job. I would bet money that you're just like me. You have passed by the history of future folk countless times. Hit play on this one when you need that pick-me-up, when you need to laugh. Now, I know this sounds like a strange movie and it might be campy and hokey, but trust me, this is an uplifting comedy that is definitely one worth watching.